Hello everyone, I'm Devin the Geek. Um, you probably know that because you clicked on the video. And a lot of you probably know me as Dark Bison in the Steam community. Um, I have something that's really puzzling about the freaking Metro game, Metro 2033, and how it performs on the ATI graphics cards. Um, uh, some of you know I am running Crossfire. Um, I have two 6850s in this computer and it, it runs perfectly on most games that use the um, you know crossfire whatever you call it technology or uses the um, type of computing for it um, but yeah this game right here Metro 2033 um, for some reason it runs very well in safe mode I don't understand why or how it why it runs like that but um, I'm in safe mode and I get like 100 FPS sometimes up to like 60 or 80 FPS you know just all the way through without any um, spikes or anything but when you play this game in normal mode the FPS like go down like dramatically um, I don't know what the big issue is here with the developers of this game and ATI drivers or something but they need to really patch this game and make it work properly or give us more options so we can customize you know the lighting and everything uh, I'm gonna show you here real fast so I'm in safe mode right now and look at my FPS I'm getting about this is on the screen I'm getting about 73 FPS right there and I want you to keep an eye on that now, oh yeah, here, here's what I'm running it as. I mean, here's what I'm running it at. I'm running it at high. Not sure if you can see that. High. There's the resolution, AA. And I have, and I do have tessellation on. Let me show you that. I don't have that DOF on, whatever you call it, DOF. Tessellation is on. And it runs perfectly. It looks exactly like the um, normal version of the game I don't know what's the deal is here but let me show you now look at the FPS look how steady they are they're just they're at 80 70 90 open the door now, let me open up this door she is always breaking down in here use the just keep an eye on those FPS now one thing in normal mode that I find a big Shake issue is is the, is the lighting the freaking lighting really brings your FPS down like a lot I again I don't know why it does that and I don't know why safe mode is much better but in safe mode I get a lot of okay. FPS so all you do is just break a light and look at the FPS it goes to like 100 something mm -hmm. seems like nobody's home Rummy. okay Okay, now look at the FPS. I'm at 80 something right now. Okay, let me. Trying to look in the viewfinder of the camera at the same time. Okay, I'm getting about 80, 70 right now. And the lighting is exactly the same as a normal mode. This is not low, low scale lighting at all. Press that, you can see that, it's perfect. Let's give it a play. I'm getting a lot of FPS, like a lot. Ready? Okay, drop down to like 40 something in that little cinematic right there. Now went back to 50 ish. Again, it's the it's the freaking lighting effects in this game. They really need to fix that.
Not sure if you can see those FPS, but they're at 50 right now. Now they're at 60-ish. 60... Um, two and it goes. It's, it's fluctuating a lot. But that's what I wanted to show you. This game works really well in safe mode, but I'm not sure what it is that's making it do that. But look at how it runs in the normal mode. I'm going to do is just restart here. Get this freaking cutscene here. All you have to do is just hit Alt and Tab and then skip that crap. Now look at the FPS. They went down to 33. That's as that's the same amount of FPS like I would probably get if I played this game on high um, with one card. For some reason, the game doesn't pick up the second card or something. But it runs like crap now. Uh, look how crappy it runs. I'm getting like 30 FPS, 40 something FPS, but over here, it's just 30 and 20 something FPS. You see that? Now, I don't know what the deal is with this game, but I'm guessing they need to fix that. You seen that lightning effect right now? I'm guessing it has a load up or something. But, um, I tried, um, earlier versions of the ATI Catalyst drivers and that doesn't seem to do anything. Um, if someone else have any tips on how to get this to work with crossfire mode so you can, like, play the game with both cards running correctly, um, please give me... A personal message or I leave a comment so everyone else can see it um, and I did some configurations inside the user data file and that doesn't seem to have did anything just yet uh, so I have to keep looking around and tweaking with that but as of right now um, it doesn't seem to have did anything actually um, the lighting effects are still the same uh, and it runs like crap uh, but in other games like Battlefield Bad Company 2, the crossfire cards work perfectly. I get a, a very, very large increase of FPS on that game when running it in crossfire. But in this game, it runs like crap. But in safe mode, it runs great. I don't know why. Um, does, does anyone know how to force this game into safe mode? Um, all I know how to do it is by like messing with these settings and it will like freaking crash randomly. <laughs> yeah, it does that with the freaking ATI cards. Um, well, AMD, whatever you want to call it, ATI, AMD. So, yeah, um, they, they these guys need to really patch this game and make it work with these video cards like ASAP because it's it's ridiculous that they would just freaking release a game that don't have a lot of options that you can customize or anything. So, yeah, um, tell me if you got any if any of you got it to work or something because I can't get it to work for crap. So yeah. See you later.